Hello family, <coughs> welcome back to yet another beautiful video. In case you've been wondering where to go and have fun, isolate yourself for recreation, uh, take your girl out, Mr. himself got you tonight. <laughs> Hello fam, thanks so much for checking out with Joel. It's me, Bugondo Pictures, okay, Hello, George Enoch is my name. And today I want to welcome you to Petima Gardens. And this is the walkway down to Petima Gardens. Hey, Joel. Yes. How are you today? I'm good, sir. How are you? How do you feel about the garden? Uh, garden, um, I'm here to confirm about it, but then I see the atmosphere. The atmosphere. Is <laughs> the atmosphere is welcoming. Mm -hmm. So let's check out and see what nature has to bring for us. Exactly. Yes. Uh, nature has to offer you a lot about this place. Uh, this Petima Gardens is located in a place called Bajo. Bajo. Yeah, so Bajo is in Seta, and that is Mukono District. It's an upcoming rich area. Oh. Uh, 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 well, it's a good neighborhood where, of course, uh, the people retire too. And uh, when you talk about uh, Mukono district, that is uh, the eastern district from the Kampala side. If you're coming from Kampala, yes. for you to get to Mukono district, okay, okay, let's go, let's go slow. Let's start by showing people here. Mm. Yes. So, this is you said it's it's a garden. Yes. Sir. What do you mean by a garden? What I mean by a garden is a, a place that you can come for camping, a place that you can can, can come for get together parties. You know, you come for recre this is a recreation garden, which is not only for camping or not only for parties that you can do. You can also come for cycling. We have the cycling here. I'm going to show you. You can ride around, and then also you can bring your kids. We have the kids ground. You can bring your kids, and then you know you have fun with your kids. That kid, the kids can play, and then we also have the swimming pool. A swimming pool for kids? Yeah, for kids, not for adults. Okay. So what do we have here today? Uh, this is um, where the serving ground. Uh, the other side is where they serve food for you. Yes. And then here we have the oven. Oven. Okay. Uh, this know, one is locally or? Uh, this is not really locally made. This is a mix-up of... Um, this already iron. This oh, yeah. is not really locally made. Like, I, like I mean, it, it uses local energy for. Yeah, this is local energy because like, you put here. Uh, you can put here charcoal. You can even see some soda ashes here. Okay. So you put here charcoal, and then here is where, where you can put your muchomo. You know muchomo? Yes, yes. Yeah. So uh, you put your muchomo beef. here. Uh, can be beef. Can be chicken. Um, we are able to the public place. Yeah, um, and we favor if we favor religion. every other person. Yes. We want neutrality. Regardless yeah. of the religion. Regardless of the religion. So we prefer that we make here uh, those fries. The three that is chicken, beef, and then cheverage for everyone here. This is the oven. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So this is okay. This is a company. Yeah. Then this this one measures temperatures. Yeah. This is temperature. This okay. To help you to know whether it is hot, it is cold, or so. Okay. Yeah. These are the flowers. These are some of the flowers. I like the flowers. Yeah. Oh, this is the still. Uh, oh, it's still it's still under construction. Yeah. We we are not complete yet because when we get done, yes, you are going to see something so different and uh, special here. Okay. Yes, sir. So, Mr. Gun Pictures, yeah. I'm seeing the lighting. Why did you choose? There are different types of. Mm -hmm. What if I don't like that uh, color? You can well, still change for uh, me. That color is a very nice color. We haven't heard of anyone who has said that they don't like that color. Yes. Okay. So, lighting at night, mm -hmm. there's not enough sufficient lighting. Mm -hmm. Design, that's a design, decoration. These are both, uh, these are tires. Okay. All right, yeah. wow, the atmosphere is so is. so cool, guys. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, guys, in case you have an outing, mm -hmm. you, have, you have friends, mm -hmm. you want to come along and enjoy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, so this is a fountain. This is what a fountain, a fountain. Yeah, yes. So, we have here, uh, this is a tire shape, but this is not a tire. Mm. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. This is not a tire itself. Uh -huh. Yes, so and then here we have the tires. And um, uh -huh. yes, so uh -huh. this this fountain yes. at night you can see the colors different. We have blue down here. Mm. And then here we have orange. Mm. And then we have How are you? Yeah, and You're then good? we have purple here. Okay. Yeah, so these are some of the things that 
the kids use for play. It rotates? Yeah, it rotates. The speed is determined by someone, not the kids who are on. Uh -uh, no, no. If you give the kids to determine the speed, they may over-determine their speed. Oh, yeah. I like it. They do not control themselves. It is you, the man, to control them. That's why you see even girls at the age of 14, at the age of 15, 16, they want to have a boyfriend. Oh, girls? Yeah. Yes. Whereas us boys, we don't have... Uh, we take time to, to, to really think that we are now mature enough to... At what age did you start having a girlfriend? I started having my girlfriend at the age of 19. 19 years old? Yes, sir. That, yo, okay. <laughs> That's and nice. At that time, I was still shy. You're still shy. <laughs> what purples look like? Purples. Yeah. Okay. I, now, mangoes. You got mangoes there. So, this is like a real field of nature, right? Yes, sir. Okay. A big field of nature. Hello. You have down the other side. You yes. Have what? Uh, you have all there, you have water in the nature. Water? Can you see me singing up? Yeah. Ah. <clears throat> hey, guy. <sighs> I'm swinging, but you know, if you quarrel with your babe, yes, the only option you have is to bring her to Petima Gardens. Yes, because you know, you buy her a bottle of soda, and then you swing from one side. She's swinging from one side, and then you tell her that I'm imagining like uh, I've taken you to Dubai. To Dubai <laughs> in Uganda, you must have that. Ex that hey. this this you feeling, feel it? yeah, this this ex good experience. Yes, sir. Yeah, yo, right, nah, nah, it's really yeah. nice. So, guys, what are you still waiting for? Yes. So here you, they make bookings through you, or some person is responsible. Uh, you book through the manager. Through the manager. Yes, and when we are able to share the manager's number, so that the person is able to book. Let's type there Petima Recreation Gardens. Okay. It's rated at five star because of its beauty. Hey, five star. Eh? Five star. The guys <laughs> who have been here. Eh? Yeah, guys who have been so here. So guys, we are in the five star garden. It's a five star garden. Recreation garden. Oh, it's a garden. A recreation garden because we do recreation activities also. Oh, recreation activities. Yeah, I told you we do cycling. Cycling. And then. Uh, we know we do camping. I come with my bike or you have your bikes? We got bikes, bro. You got them? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got uh, bikes, yeah, so you don't need to come with your bike. Yeah, I'm seeing. And then also we have volleyball here. Volleyball. You know right? how to play volleyball? Yeah, I know. I used to Are play. Are you serious? Very serious. Not football. Both. Football I and play volleyball. football, volleyball. See. Like, like uh, maybe I, I don't like this color. I just pluck it off i put my own yeah you bulb. can you, you can put your bow but these are the bows that have been in here remember test and preferences differ right? yeah yes yeah. but you know uh, you see we have even those in that mango tree mm. they are lights there okay let's go and show them like we're showing them the whole garden right yeah, yeah. so guys see how the garden looks and it's far away from town from kapar city eh? yes. just away if you want a place far away from kapar town without mm -hmm. destruction yeah, that's mm -hmm. noisy, mm -hmm. air pollution, mm -hmm. just want to feel nature. Mm -hmm. Actually, you know that people who live, who stay mm -hmm. near nature, live longer. Exactly. Yeah, they exactly. get that fresh oxygen to exactly. breathe. Exactly. You know, we get a lot of oxygen here. That's why um, I remember telling you about... Not just oxygen, but fresh oxygen. Fresh oxygen. Yes. Yeah. And uh, mm. you can feel it from down here. Yes, you can feel the oxygen. You, you can actually even see the beauty of the trees here. And yeah. They are all giving nature. They are all giving nature. And we are giving them the by the, the what what we are breathing the carbon dioxide. And they are they're giving us the pure oxygen. Pure oxygen, which is not contaminated with any traffic. There is no there is no fuel that has gone there. There is nothing. Yes. No air pollution that has affected it. So, um, <laughs> like we talked before, uh, living in a nature area is is a strong life for for any other life person. Yes. You know, we are born of humans. Exactly. Even the Bible clearly says that God created man from where? That dust. Yes. And whatever you see up here, it is given its life back from the dust. And when you get to breathe this real nature, you're buying life to your life. Yes. People in the blues, they live longer because of nature. Okay, um, it's estimated to be 85 years above? Uh, 90 years. 90 years. 90 years. It's, they actually have the highest or the longest lifespan in the whole world. Yes. Yeah, but of course now we also have people from Morocco. They are getting to 85%, uh, 85 years. Those are women, not men. Exactly. Uh, how do you call it? A jackfruit. Jackfruit, eh? Yeah. Yeah, so this also gives nature back. Nature. Okay. See, like you, sometimes you find a lot of birds come around here. And then they begin singing, they begin <coughs> whistling. 
Actually, <coughs> if you're being stressed a lot, we advise you to come to Petima Gardens because in Petima Gardens, you ref we, we create that atmosphere, the ambience that can help you to refresh yourself. You get in that um, you, you get to live away from the mind of uh, work stress, the home burdens, um, the challenges around you. You get to be out away from that. And then, you know, you have enough time to be able to see nature. You see the trees and then you're able to see birds. When you came earlier on, you're able to see some birds. Yeah, actually, okay, I saw. It, yeah. it reminded me of my childhood memories. Yeah, exactly. Um, we had a lot of bush around us. In that the homes were distant, you could even go for two kilometers, one kilometer without finding another home. But as we talk today, you can stand from here and you're able to see the other home. So um, it is completely changed. It is completely changed. And I was super excited when I looked on Twitter. There was uh, a family of uh, a couple mm. that was able to plant up to 14 million trees in Brazil. 14 million trees in the spell of 18 years. That that one shocked me. You know, they planted 14 million trees in a spell of 18 years in Brazil. A place that was so bare, it was kind of mountainous, and then these people are able to plant the trees to put back nature. And the changes that we have, the mm. climatic changes that we have, is because we have dealt mercilessly with nature. Yeah, yeah this is... Uh, that is a uh, handmade pot. <laughs> yeah, 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 like someone was trying to mold it. Uh, some kids. Some kids. Yeah. It will be around here. Yeah. Okay. Around here. Yeah, okay. Come around here. Okay. So, Mr. Bugoma Pictures. Yes, sir. Can take fireplace. A fireplace. Yeah, this is a fireplace. Uh, because we do a camping and we. Enter, camping? Yeah, because yeah. we do camping, we know that at, at night this place gets very cold. Uh, just after there, as you could show them, as you've showed them, just down there. That's already now um, a swampy area where we have a lot of water. And because the place is exposed to water, we should be able to have a fireplace so that, you know, you catch your drink, but you catch your drink in where there is some fire. This is to let in, this yeah. outlet is to let in oxygen. To, to let the oxygen, and then here is where it is, the real fire. You'll see the real fire burning off from here. Real <laughs> fire. It's also like a girlfriend. Yeah, yeah. Oh, not yet. Not, not yet. yet. Not yet. yet. Not, not yet. We are oh, still, yes. We are still that oh. developing young men. Oh, yes. So, you know, like when you're struggling, it's hard to get someone to trust yeah, yeah. what you're doing. Uh, kindly, let's, let's engage here. Yeah. Um, is it really hard to get someone who can, who, whom you can trust when you're struggling? It's hard, like especially or in this it kind of economy. Someone, or it, it is hard to get someone who can trust you. It's hard. To get someone who can trust me, okay, I'm, I, I tell someone, mm. uh, I, um, I have a dream, yeah. I'm a YouTuber, but in a few years time, mm. I'm going to be able to provide you with good stuff. Mm. I'll be able to provide you with those nice phones, mm. iPhones, mm. I can be able to buy you a, a, a luxurious car, mm. some sort of sort. Someone can't really, you know, guys don't want to, mm. how do I call it? They don't want to settle with someone mm. who's still struggling. They want to settle with someone who's already made. They who's don't want already established. Established. They don't want to be in that struggle. Oh, that's why they would rather date uh, an old man of 65 years yeah, some sort of who sort. is rich, uh, other than you of 27, and who is promising. Who is promising <laughs> to build. <laughs> like, to build uh, uh, like, you, you know, it, it's true. I'm going yeah. to be that person if yes. I work hard. Yeah. I put in enough dedication yeah. towards it. But yeah. then you, you get bad energy from the girl. Yeah. You vibe a girl. Today, tomorrow, she's with like 50 or... Like yeah. a number of guys, you get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So basically, what I'm saying is, for mm. now, it's about struggling like, to to pick up. To pick up. Yeah. It's time for relationship. No, no, oh, no. Wow. So wow. I think you can. Yeah, you can. Yeah. Uh -huh. So uh, this place, if you're cycling, yes. Um, this is like your runabout. So this 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 was you. Uh, this was uh, this so, was me. Uh, I, Need some water. <laughs> uh, you need to refresh. You uh, understand? I refresh. Guys, I love water. I take yeah. uh, gallons of water in a day. That's why you're a handsome man. You, oh, bro, I want to keep more handsome. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Oh, oh, by the Joel, yeah. I, I've been more handsome and I want to get more handsome. Yeah, you, yeah. Should. <laughs> you should. Wherever you're watching this video from, Yo. Uganda has handsome guys. guys. Yeah. 
strong and, and, for real, and we are handsome. I mean, and dedicated towards achieving our dreams. Our dreams, yeah. And uh, we look towards uh, leaving and leaving behind us a legacy. Not just only having being handsome. We are handsome, yes, physically, but we are more handsome with brains. Yes, because, brains. Yeah, we are not uh, senselessly handsome. And uh, our purpose is, by the time we, they celebrate us as you know the handsome old men who lived there should be a legacy that the young people are celebrating about us. About that. So we are laying foundations. We are laying foundations. You're going to see more bigger YouTubers coming from Uganda. Yes. I and uh, we're setting a ground for them. Yes, yeah. that's true, yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so big up to every YouTuber in Uganda. Keep doing what you're doing, bro. Exactly. Keep doing what you're doing, sisters. Exactly. And let's believe and let's trust the process. Exactly. Time and consistency. Yeah. Everything will work out. Exactly. Yo. Just be passionate of what you do. Know what you want to do and believe in yourself you know sometimes you don't need another person to believe in yourself for you to know who you are you need to believe in yourself for other people to know who you are if you keep waiting for other people to believe in you i'm telling you they will not believe in you until you believe in yourself yeah so get started as a youtuber and believe in yourself so strong that you're able to achieve it actually like what you are doing it's good to always be in relationship in relationship with yourself exactly love yourself exactly do what you're doing keep exactly. doing it at your best and thank you so much for our subscribers who are always with us yeah. watching our videos yeah. i know we are getting better and better exactly. every day so exactly. my brother runs a channel called Bugondo pictures can you go and check him out yeah. check yeah. his work yeah give him a thumbs up subscribe to his cha yeah. channel yeah. You know, there's a lot coming. Uh, a lot. If you go right now and check that channel, um, even if you don't feel like uh, what is there is up to the standard you'd expect, yeah. I want you to understand that what is there is the beginning. That's not my end. <laughs> I'm on my yeah. way. <laughs> yeah, bro. So don't <laughs> don't judge my wife. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's exactly, yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah. Just go there and stay there. Yeah. And the only way you can stay there is by hitting that red button, the subscribe button. Just, sorry. <laughs> stay there. Some 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 apps like when you use some phone, it's always black. It's always hitting, it's black or red. <laughs> it's either black or red. Yeah, I'm trying to say if you cannot read, but if you can read it, kindly read the word subscribe, click. Click it, click it, and even hit the bell. Actually, before doing this video, we had a massive meeting yeah, here. Yeah. We're coming up with <laughs> new <laughs> ideas. Massive, yeah. <laughs> Epic. <laughs> we had a bombastic <laughs> meeting, bro. A ballistic. <laughs> yeah, ballistic <man. laughs> All right, let's keep watching. <laughs> <Yeah. Now. laughs> hey. Yeah. Oh, man, Mr. Bugo on the pictures. Yeah, so we have a lot of a lot to show you so uh this is the right way right way um i we told i told you before that uh, uh so you, 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 excuse me like we said yeah now the whole of, from this side onwards yeah it's a swamp that's a swamp it's it's pure water it's like actually it's like you're inside like a forest uh, yes we're inside a forest a forest like that nature keeps exactly. calling you can see it I mean, nature calls for life, and life calls for nature. No, nah, oh, yo, <laughs> <laughs> that's massive, bro. Yeah, so you can continue. This you're saying this yeah, is the right way. A, yeah, this is the right way. Uh, if you're cycling, yes, uh, you, you, you can feel like it makes a roundabout. Okay, like this. it's round. So yes, so when you come from this side, you have to come, and then you make that runabout before you can proceed. Okay. Yeah. That's where. You don't uh when you are, when we are taking pics, what we mind is the camera is there. <laughs> Sometimes if uh, the videographer or the photographer cannot tell you that you smile, uh, you don't have you don't care. Mm. You just go straight and then you, you know you're able to just face it up. Uh, uh we don't do any makeup before we take a pic. Uh, you don't do it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but first Yo. Yo. Oops, okay. Can say hello to our people. Say hello. Hello. Hi. How are you guys? Yeah. Yo, you do photography? Yeah, we are photography. Mm -hmm. Can say your name here. Maybe you can check you out. Okay, I'm um, Elvis. Kasuma Elvis. Okay. Kasuma Elvis. Yeah. Uh, which is your handle? Uh, like WhatsApp or social media? Yeah, social media handle. Twitter, Instagram, Cuts Photography, Uganda. Cuts, ah, Cuts, Cuts Photography. Cuts Capture One. Cuts Capture One. Instagram. 
Oh, bro. Right. Hey, hey guys. To Facebook. Yeah. Okay. Still cuts capture one. Cuts right. capture one. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. And okay. you capture your book? Hello. I'm, yeah. I'm capturing my first uh, photograph. Oh, he's, I thought he's a client. <laughs> yeah. Can you imagine? Do you tell even your clients to go down like this? Yeah. Oh. Actually, this is the way we do it. Guys, okay. you're so creative. I, yeah. yeah you're I didn't. Creative. Mm -hmm. yeah. Wow. I really appreciate it. It's hard work. It's like, yeah, you know, really coming up work. with such, such art. Mm. All right. Thank oh, you for man. All right, please. Eh? Good day. Good day. Stay up, flowers around. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah. bro. So, guys. Whenever a girl puts up a picture on her Instagram handle, yeah. Facebook, or on her social media handle, mm -hmm. please, guys, make sure to like that picture. Honestly speaking, do you know one thing I've come to know with girls? Yes. Um, I got a babe, a yeah. very beautiful babe at home. Yes. And um, they never do things like we do. No. They have time for everything. Yes. What I mean is, um, if it is to take photos, they, they consider their nails, they consider their hair, mm. they consider their teeth, they consider everything. For us guys, ah, it's just a run on. Yeah. They are able to become Your the other, Yeah, they are able to become the other person of you. But it is hard for you to find a man yeah. who does not like football, then a woman turns him to love football. It's hard. It's hard. It's very hard. But it is easier. Oh, we just pretend for a bit. He will pretend if he wants something from you. He pretend a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Especially if he wants to do one, two. Hey. But here, after he has done one, two, the guy goes back. <laughs> 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 no more sense. <laughs> Be like, yo, if it's such a project. Mm. I, I, yo, uh, I got... No, I, I didn't like that thing. I, I was like... just doing, I was just doing, but that's not my thing. Yeah. And he pulls away completely. You get so bad. Uh, as a lady, yeah. you should be willing to fall into what the guy is into. Okay. And if you married someone that you see is focused to dream, you know, one thing that women do not know is before you marry someone, ask them what is your vision for life. And then you have to look to whether you can buy into that vision. If the guy does not have the, uh, the vision that matches you, I mean, pull out from this guy. Other than you pulling the guy in, and you know, men fall into relationship for truth, by the way. Uh, women like the thing of you know here and there the hit and run. Women or men? Uh, it depends, but most time women hit and run. <laughs> are you are you real? I'm yeah. real because I've I've never hit and run. Uh, yeah, uh, so. Okay, me also. Mm. I'm sick of my point. Like me, I'm real a real person. When I'm yeah. going for something, I really mean. And th that only happens with people who are focused. If you find a focused man, he has no time for hit and run. If you find a focused woman, she has no time for hit and run. So, so you mean if a lady is like, like, like if she's not not a hit and run woman, she should put a comment in the comment section below. Yeah, yeah, uh, for please. future for future reference. For future reference. Uh, yes, uh, I put and say that I'm not hit and run. Eh, uh, for future reference. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you, anyone who is not hit and run, they're developmental by the way. Yes. So put it here. Leave it down. Leave the comment section. Leave your comment in the comment section below. Down, down, for future down, reference. Down, down. In a Say few years, I can come and reply it back. <laughs> can I come and reply back and be like, hey. Oh, yes. Hey, yeah. yeah you, probably you can you leave it up there. Leave it up. It's important. Really, it's important. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and you have uh, guys who are not hit and run. They can also still check out that. Yeah. They are. <laughs> Oh, by the way, Joel is not hit and run. He said it. No, no, <laughs> he no, cannot no. check out. <laughs> well, you know, I'm not also ready for relationship right now because, mm -hmm. bro, we are just a bigger dream. We don't need distractions. Yeah, and uh, that's why, whoever, if you're watching and you have an intention to say, like, hey, I want to pull up with Joel, you should be pulling up with a bigger dream. Yeah, big. yeah you should have a bigger dream, babe. Don't just come with. Uh, a mega dream, you know what they call mega? This minor thing. Minor. <laughs> yeah, hey, you're coming for something for temporal. Yes. Our dreams are to die, and the dreams continue living for us. So for us. That's true. We are big. We are chasing for bigger dreams, bigger and dream. then you should be able to build that dream. That's why you see mm. yesterday. Today we are better than yesterday. yesterday. Yeah. Every day we keep on improving. Every day. If you see our videos from behind, yeah. you can see that there is an improvement. No, when I just started, man, the videos that I made, if I watch them right now, I don't even want to watch for so long. Yeah. After I watch, and I'm big like, big up to every other YouTuber hmm. and every other person who is helping us achieve this in any other way, supporting us, like 
giving us ideas and yeah, so yeah yeah you know, yeah big up to bigger people you know we cannot mention all your names yeah, but, but uh, they know we know you we know you and you know your, yourselves you know that you've been part of uh, this journey yeah and uh, my almighty yeah keep saying may the almighty bless you and give you the best of what you want exactly yeah. and eternity will not forget your names no it won't. yeah <laughs> 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 yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Your names are written in eternity. Yes, right? they will always be read. Yeah. Because every time anyone is going to be applauding our work, they yeah, applauding your work in direct. They are going to use it as pure yeah. reference. Exactly. So even someone who fails to support us, you feel like yeah, you, what you're doing is good. Mm -hmm. Can go and check us in our our YouTube channels. We always yeah. leave our contact details. You can yeah, check out yeah. on me. Check out on him. Yeah. I say, bro. Thanks for the hard work. Yeah. Chup, chup, some message. And, yeah, it matters, bro. It matters. It matters. No, that chup, chup is chup, chup to me. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, like, yeah, you know that's how, how, we, how we go. Mm. We shall live to tell such stories. Yeah, exactly. Okay. And you know, um, some of the projects we are doing, they are really informing the community. And, I feel they are bringing in investors. Yeah, they are bringing in investors. And um, we are, after looking at a positive narrative, for our country of course we believe uganda is not to a particular level mm. but we believe uganda has a better narrative to tell yes than the narrative which is already being told yes um the europeans not only uganda but most of the african countries they have been able to have a different narrative which went viral but also we are trying to say that yes that narrative was there that was the time but that's not still the same uganda we are not in the uganda of 1900 no yeah uganda has by far moved a mile regardless of the government regardless of the political issues that we could have uganda is developed we have had individuals that have participated in developing the country so these videos are helping and they are the most authentic videos of how Uganda looks like. They are to help you if you're coming to visit Uganda, mm -hmm. you should come with a different mind and know that you are not meeting people who are wild. You're not meeting people who are dangerous. Mm -hmm. You know those days they say that Uganda uh, Africans are wild. We are not wild, we no. are educated and we are sober. We are educated because yeah. I've, I've, even for example, if you ask, mm. even as we are educated men, yeah. yeah, we are trying to use the skills we got from school. Exactly. Transform exactly. yeah, yeah. our community. Exactly. And, yeah. uh, we are just applying. Yeah. yeah, we are just applying. We we don't want the thing of sitting down and saying that, hey, there is no job. Yeah, yes, there could be no job, but there is work. Yeah, I like yeah. <laughs> job is what we get from another person. Work is what God gave us. And God gave all of us the skills, He gave all of us the brains. So he entrusted us with something. There is no way we can die and then go back and say, oh God, I did not do this because there was no job. I have also known of people who did not even go to school, but they have a legal already. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, they are, they are made a legal. And they are employing they people who went to school. Yes. So it doesn't really need for you to have, to go to school and have a job to be able to, to change mm. a generation. You can pick up from right now. Okay. Yeah, so that was so beautiful and a moment of conversation, bro. Yeah, thanks so much. 